Dude, wow, yeah, you know, days. I didn't think anybody so would show awesome. up. That's usually most of my birthday party stuff, you know, but wow, very excited about the turnout. All right, guys, welcome back. We're out here for another one. We're out here at uh, Art of Attack. They, they dropped a flyer like Friday night that they were doing something today. So today's gonna be a fun one. They, uh, they're they doing uh, kind of like a pre-release or a celebration that they're doing um, a mirror from RS Future and NADS uh, have, a new, have a new program dropping on Motor Trend. So they're holding this meet kind of as a pre to that. Uh, out here at Art of Attack, you know how it goes. It's always, always crazy. So uh, we're just catching rolling right now. They have four door 34. That's cool. You got a little four door 34 right here. Uh, so we're getting rolling and uh, we'll take you guys through what's going on today. So you guys let me know what you think. As always, drop those comments and uh, we're going to get at it and go have some fun. All right. Set up a, a white cars we have here. Um, so we've got what a 64 impala i don't know the years but uh, well, how do you not know the years anyways it's a gorgeous impala it's like dumped out red. yeah like super clean you got the you get the nsx next to it so it's a hard top because usually when they're targets the paint matches the top ah uh, the paint matches the dra oh um so then we got the supra <laughs> At the race spec. This thing is clean though, dude. The Supra? Yeah. yeah. It, it looks it looks really good. I like that. I don't know, something like a track like a full a, an actual yeah. track spec car, yeah. Yeah, I have no problem with it being dirty, when beat up. Battle scars, it's like yeah. adds to the yeah. Yeah. we'll see uh it's an all track, so it's all, all wheel drive. drive. Yeah, we'll see if they open up the hood and what it looks like underneath. Um we got we got the uh, the Need for Speed. We got the Need for Speed oh, yeah, M3. The most yeah, the most wanted M3 over yeah, that's here. Sick. Never played that game. Uh, really? Oh, that that one. I think Most Wanted was the was the best one out of the group. I agree. Um, right? Uh, the FD carbon doors, all carbon accents, carbon hatch. Why? Well, look how wide it is, man. 8.6? Yeah, it, it doesn't that even look good. like it anymore. Like, it changes it. yeah. You got the wide body R35. Oh, got the Evo. Look at this little guy right here. Look how cute he is. Oh, he even gave me the smile. He is super cute. Got the Evo. Uh, the old Jag right here. He's got a little little hidden fun under the hood. On BBSs. That's the one with the, the 2J. So like I said, we're we're still doing roll in. Got a really, really clean 32 coming in. He's got the he's got the wing on it that has like the active stabilization if it's the same wing. Yeah, it is. It's the wing that has the active stabilization, which is pretty cool. So it has like uh, has like the little air brake set up on it. I've seen this on a on a BMW. It's uh it's pretty cool. Yeah, you, you had the best co-pilot right here. Ah, buddy. So you guys check out this vet or I guess what's left of it being a vet. So, huge set of wheels, tires. You got the, the drift spec on it. You got the, the 2J under the hood. Um, I mean, I guess you don't need doors on this side. <laughs> the driver's side actually has doors, but there's, there's literally no body. Look, it's just, just pure open, like rolling chassis. Um, it's, I mean, it's it's kind of cool because everything's exposed. You can see like, like the tranny mounts. You know, you can see it's not connected, so you know it doesn't have a drive shaft in it yet. With the 2J, 
So you got the like cantilever uh, suspension. This this is just this is an insane build. Like this is this is really cool. I can't wait to see it. Um, oh yeah, we didn't mention it's also right-hand drive, but you know this this is definitely an insane insane car. Um, so you got this one. You get this one right next to um, the other the other SEMA vet over here that has you know the ITBs on it, which is kind of a kind of a cross in between doing like a like a USDM and a JDM type of build. I, I mean, I really I really like it. I've never seen a vet look this good, wide bodied, you know. There, well, there's a reason it was a SEMA car. And then you have the the Styron next to it, or TSI TSI Conquest, depending on which uh, you know which body, which brand it is. And then um, get out of the way of the photographer real quick. And then what you'll see under the hood is they they went with. Uh, a super reliable LS3 engine in it which that's that's cool so that's that's another another fun just wild car we've got uh, the little Lotus here I'm guessing since the hatch is up this is probably swap two with yep so as you'd expect a, a K swap because that's what most people do it makes the power you want it to make doesn't add any extra weight You got the motorsport hardware uh, BMW over here. He started this up earlier and it is super, super loud. Um, but yeah, this is one of the ones that runs Haltech Dash and everything else. Pure, pure race car, just the way it should be. It looks really good. So, looks like they're gonna start playing music, so. You sure? Yeah, his, head's like oh, his head gets bigger each time? Oh, I get it. Oh, so that's cool. Um, they're actually not opening up the inside today, which is, which is weird, because normally they have everything prepped. Um, I just bumped into a mirror Mirror's like, hey, I can I can let you inside real quick for a couple seconds. So I'm gonna show you guys. They got just a ton of really good customer cars in here. So we'll go over real quick, and I'll just kind of kind of pan through, show you guys, and then we'll get out of here and let them get back to doing their thing. So let's uh, let's run around this way and just show them. So we got the NSX, the EK. You got the. EP3 right hand drive EP3 yeah like that's cool so you got a right hand drive type R EP3 on Mugens this is really cool you got a FK8 type R full race prep wide body I saw this one last time we were here they were working on it um, as you can see, they got a lot of really good race cars. So you got new NSX, got a couple just frames. This looks like the old import tuner one um, that was an old cover car. I think, I think that's Joey's car, I'm actually not sure. You got a R32 half ripped apart in the back. Um, and then just a, a bunch of really good cars. You got the 
EK9 up here that we've seen at the track. Supra. Yeah, this is actually a really good group of cars like parked over here. Yeah, it's kind of like a private collection back here. Um, yeah. So, and of course we've seen the, the, the G80 race. Yeah. Got another, another FK9 on Volks. EK9, thank you. I know, I know. I'm so excited to be back here. Got a club racer spec, GR. Yeah, you don't see any preludes anymore. So, um, completely gutted and stripped S2K back there. Like, and that's a CR, if I believe. That's it's the right color for the CR, right? That apex blue or whatever it is. That's pretty cool. On some AO52s, that's a lot of meat on that. That's a wide rear. That is a lot. So that, that's, that's going wide bodied. Yeah, because it has no engine or nothing in it, so that's cool. It's cool the customer cars because like they're all ripped apart. You don't normally get to see them. Like you always get to see them finished. Yeah. So got the rear mount. It's cool to see the like header setup and everything right here. That's that's cool. Yeah, that Yeah. And then the Porsche. They have so many good cars. And on the advents too. So yeah. Yeah, because it's the, the Porsche. Not, yeah. The Porsche comes yeah, with the center not, locks. The the rear exhaust, the rear the center mount rear exhaust. Because the they brought it up from behind the plate instead of lower because the rear diffuser and everything. Also, the exhaust would be lower or interfere with that. Yeah, so it doesn't mess with that. It's like how clean the dash swap is. That's, like, that's an RSX. Yeah. yeah, it's got an RSX yeah. dash in it. Yeah. yeah, it's super, super clean. And then, of course, they have a bunch of aero parts and everything else. So, um, all right. So we don't overstay our welcome. We're going to get out of here. Um, we're going to get you guys back out to the other show. See, they're already closing the, the garage door and everything on everybody. So, yeah, we're going to get out of here and show you guys the rest of the show. Hey, man. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Got the headlight conversion, got the JDP lip, it's pretty cool, got the, the little all coming in together, yeah, a fun little group. This is the way, the white one's the way mine was set up, I had the same carbon lip. I just didn't have the little tail what on the wing. wing. Yeah, nice. that's the sport wing. Yeah, it awesome. They just has it tilted. So what you do is you you do a little bracket. You do a little bracket so you can tilt it. Yeah. There you go. It's the uh, most important car of the car show right here. You get your rice balls of fire. Pulled in with an S15 on BBSs. Mm, that's nice and clean.
bitch, I can't delay. Yeah. Like, they the same, cause once you made a way, they can't that phase. You gotta make a way, they can't that phase. Yeah. But in a way, I made a way. Call my lane, I paved the way. Drew it up nice, I made the play. What a good day to get paid today. But in a way, I made the way. Call my lane, I paved the way. Drew it up nice, I made the play. Ball on the wall, fade away. Hey. Alright, so we're starting to roll out. Um, nice R32. Getting out of here. That's 14. It's a really good setup. Color's beautiful. Owner said he just got the, the half case down in the back. I can't wait to see him get the color on this. It, the interior is going to look great. Let's see what else we got over here. We got. Some people all waiting to pull in, pull out. Evo's getting, trying to find a good spot. The Huracan that just pulled in. Got the Top Secret Supra. Along with the NSX over here. The group of cars is just really, really cool. So that's pretty cool. We've seen it at a couple of the events. The car's completely, completely done. Everything. It's really nice. And you have the, the NSX next to it, and then all the all the stance cars in the background. All right, guys. So what do you think? Um, this art look art of attack always hosts just absolutely incredible events um so this one this one today like we said is is with super street um amir and nads you know getting ready to to drop their uh their new program that they're doing with motor trend and um they dropped this last minute to host and look not very many people missed because there is a ton a ton of really good cars out here that s15 with the vq underneath uh four-door gtr uh 34 i got uh purple 33 over here fd um i mean you got the 2.5 up here super like that's that's how it goes like it's it's non-stop now the only thing that didn't happen today okay was they didn't open up the inside of the garage they kept everybody outside but we were so lucky we bumped into Amir and Amir was just awesome and and let us take a quick walk through um, of of the inside of the warehouse say hi to the guys um, that's all that's it that's the only time they get on the video um, but yeah so Amir was really cool and let us uh, let us take a quick walk through kind of see the customers cars that were in there that they were working on um, which which was really cool of them um, there's a ton of really good right hand drives out here and just a ton of really good cars and people just spent the last uh the last 10 minutes uh 15 minutes talking with uh big mike and ryan um those guys are super cool we were talking about cars talking about old school like where where the industry came from and built up we were talking about like the original fast and the furious and all of that and and literally we were just hanging out hey buddy um so i I mean, that's how it's supposed to go out here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. You guys let me know what you think. Um, as always, as always, I appreciate you. Thank you hanging out to the end. And um, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to head to the next one. And uh, we're going to keep doing this. All right, I'll see you guys at the next one. Thanks.